Hello, everybody. Welcome back to American Truck Simulator. Uh, just uh, another quick uh, little run today. Got the uh, Freeliner Cascadia with a Dewey Pile uh, livery on it. Uh, running uh, some, uh, some cardboard from Goodyear uh, here in uh, Oklahoma. Um, it's going to be a short little jaunt today. Um, I was like, oh, you know, I kind of want to change it up from all the custom trucks I've been running. Uh, so, uh, I figured, you know, let's, uh, get some, uh, real-life liveries going on here today. So, uh, yeah, so like I said, we got the Freightliner Cascadia. Um, it is a 12-speed, um, actually, that's what it came with. Uh, the only thing I changed on it was, uh, I put the chrome bumper and grill on it, and I put the livery on it. Other than that, it's how it would come if you just, uh, yeah, you're in the game. Um, no, very, very no-frills truck. Uh, so just like any, uh, any manufacturer would purchase it. Um, so yeah, so let's get to, uh, let's get to going here. Get my map up. <clears throat> there we go. Okay. So, I hope everybody's had a, had a good Get weekend so far. Uh, right. it's, weather's been kind of lousy here, uh, this weekend. Uh, this whole week was pretty nice, though. Uh, didn't get past the upper 70s. So, it was, uh, definitely fall-like weather. Nice. Uh, finally, I mean, last, you know, week and a half of September. Um, but, no, things are... Weather's nice, except for the weekend, but... Yeah, not everything can be perfect. Oh, so, um. Well, uh. Oh, well, I want to consider a real update on the whole moving situation. Uh, still struggling to find a place to live. Uh, plan was to, uh, move away, but, uh. It'd be happening, unfortunately. Get ready to turn right. It would be nice. It would be nice to, you know, have a change. <laughs> but hopefully, uh, hopefully we'll find something here soon. Oh, really? Ah, uh, of course. Yep. Thanks. A lot. That's how I wanted my trip to start. <clears throat> I might just stop and dead. Come on, people. Jeez, AI is horrible in this game. There's some GTA AI. Um, but yeah, <clears throat> hopefully soon we can get back to streaming. I kind of miss that. It's, uh, kind of crappy not being able to stream, honestly. I have, uh, me and everybody, we have way too much fun streaming. But, uh, my modem is just... <laughs> my modem is, uh, kind of deathly old at this point. Um, in terms of, you know, technology. Uh, I think it's, oh, I don't know, four years old or so. So it's pretty outdated. I mean, just shortly after we got this one, Xfinity came out with a, a new style one. It's the same generic look to it, but it's, it's white and it's just updated, so. Hopefully, uh, hopefully that'll get updated here soon. I would like to be able to start streaming again. Um, not being able to is kind of got me a little bit of a funk. Uh, you know, it's that one thing that I enjoy doing, and now I don't have it. I mean, I can give it a shot again with the uh, with the old modem. Um, but I'm just, I'm, I'm just, 
afraid, you know, that the, the feeling that because it's done it before to me, just, you know, just dropped Wi-Fi entirely, that, uh, that issue is going to happen again just because of bandwidth that I'm using when I'm streaming. Keep right <clears throat> and then turn right. But, uh... Turn right. Maybe, uh... Maybe here soon it'll actually work well with me. And, uh... Yeah, this is different to drive. <clears throat> uh, this thing does have a, uh... Has a Detroit... <clears throat> I just can't remember exactly what model Detroit it is. Can you me from never remembering? But it's uh, it seems to be a pretty comfortable truck, though. No, I mean it's other than when people stop dead in front of you for no reason. It's always an issue. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm getting there. I only go as fast as I can go. Go straight on. Keep left and then turn left. The engine is just so quiet. Harrison. Turn left. Crazy. I was really thinking this thing was going to come with a uh, automatic. Straight but... on. <clears throat> yep, see? It's like in real life. Where? Horrible. Wow, this transmission has a large gear spread. Pretty crazy. Why does that say we're going to zero miles an hour there in the digital display? Weird. Why would you have a stoplight here? It's through a 70 mile per hour interstate. Oh, well, I'm running it. I don't care. Yep. <clears throat> oh, because it dropped down to 50 there for a second. Oh, well. Slow down and touch. Yeah, so this week, uh, I haven't even checked the weather this week or what it was going to be like. You know, tomorrow's going to be a lot of the same. Uh, you know, 50s. Come on, dude, turn, turn. Holy Jesus. Go straight on. Terrible. Can't see a lot with this though. It's kind of nice. Decent truck for me. Nothing, uh, nothing to write home about, but I don't know. I don't know. Oh, 319. Gosh, I would love it if gas was 319. It'd be so flipping nice. Sorry, just looking at the controls. <clears throat> ah, I, keep, I don't know why I keep forgetting it shift. I keep thinking it's gonna shift for me. I think it's an automatic. Oh, Texas Road. Oh, you know what? I went to Texas Roadhouse a couple weeks ago for the first time ever. And I have to say, that was flipping unbelievable. <clears throat> I, I don't know how I've never gone before, but it was so good. Like, buddy of mine 
It's like, oh, you're going to love the rolls and the butter. And yeah, he wasn't kidding. Like, I could live on the rolls and butter from that place. Go straight on. It was pretty crazy how good they are. Then uh, I had the... Uh, at the 12 ounce Keep New right York strip. And then exit right. Um, exit right. And uh, that was that was wicked good. Wicked good. Um, ended up having. Uh, I also have potato skins. Keep right. And those were really good too. Like I, I couldn't believe the size of the appetizer plate. Uh, I I was so hungry that night, but I ended up. Uh, what are you do? What is going on with AI today? <clears throat> I mean, there's clearly enough room for you to keep going. Whatever. I'm not even gonna attempt to try to figure that out. Right, and then turn. Not like there's flashy lights on the truck that would make it uh, make somebody want to just turn stop. Right. I don't know. I'll never figure it out. Granted, I can't tell exactly where the front of this truck Keep is. That's one of the big problems. Right. Left. Oh, that might be uh, that might be my issue. I might be crowding the stop line a bit. Oh well, whatever. Oh, we're going to Swift with cardboard. Interesting. Turn right. Turning right. Was a good year trailer here. Huh. Funny. This is where it ends. This is where it ends. Yeah, I know. All right. Back it up. Oh, easy peasy. Hopefully. Bring her in. Around, back her in. Crank the wrong way. Come on, come on. Bring around. Yeah, oh, I screwed that all up, but whatever. Get there. A lot harder than it looks. Yeah, I'm having this problem again where I am. Keep cutting myself the wrong way. Air back around. Right, look at that. I freaking pull into a swift yard and I lose all ability to, to back up. Ah, go figure. Yep, yeah, no, that's horrible. Come on, you can do so much better than that. I know you can. <clears throat> I 
should have had this first shot, but whatever. If this was real life. Ah, see, I did it again. As soon as I put my head out the window, I throw myself off. All of a sudden, I'm... There we go. Finally. Okay, even though the backing up took a little bit, still got an excellent, so I guess that's all that matters. I guess that's all that matters. Well, that'll be it for this, uh, for this episode of American Truck Simulator. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope you guys had a great time watching me struggle to back that trailer up, hit that car, and everything else I did completely wrong today. Um, and, uh, yeah, I hope everybody has a great week. And if I don't see you before then, uh, I'll see you next weekend. Thank you so much.